Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Cardon's Jards, brought to you by the like button and also uh, following on Twitch and subscribing on YouTube because boy, oh boy, we keep getting closer by the day to achieving one nil, what we never thought possible, but here we are. Oh, apparently I over-ordered card sleeves. Whoops, I guess I could like expand that onto a different shelf just so that there's like some additional space for it in case we need. There's a nice amount of card sleeves that are left though. Okie dokie. Guys, is today the day that the $16,200 card is gonna jar? Let me check the market price on it and make sure that we're not over asking. Otherwise, it's gonna be very, very sad. Detramon Ghost, and then it was on the second page, right? Ooh, it went up another $62. All right, I'll leave the price as is, but it should look like a better deal to the, the people now. Right? Okay, where's Jack Turn? Is Jack Turn going? Oh my god, dude. Jack Turn's going down. What the heck? Why is Jack Turn going down? This is so sad. I guess it's not like that down versus what it's been, but it's still, you know, hey, on the plus side, this keeps going. Look at this. Yo, we got in at the right time on this stonks. We were like here, and then it's just going uppity, uppity, uppities. Pretty cool. Okay, someone. Look at it, look at it, Walter White. Please, it was only $17 and you're not even gonna go for it? That's crazy, it was next to the $16,200 card. God dang it. There are gonna be some non-believers thinking there's no chance he's gonna be able to pull that until like level 30 something. But I'm a believer, we can make it happen. All right, let's open some of the, uh, the you know, high level or high, higher, First pack of the day. I was literally in the middle of saying, let's open up some of the ones who are higher chance of getting ghost and then we just freaking get a ghost. What is this the craziest thing that's ever happened in the history of the universe on pack number one? Holy frick, dude. Pack number one. Oh my God. Yeah, I couldn't even say what I was trying to say. I couldn't finish my thought. We were already going ghost. Dude, imagine if on the first pack of the day, I started off with Call Me Danny Phantom because we going ghost and it had hit. Oh, the one time I don't do it. I ruined it for myself. Dang it. SMH my head. Uh, Godzilla fan, thank you for the sub, AKA I patch three months. Uh, how has it been this long already? I mean, it's, it's three months. I mean, I'm old, so I guess three months just seems like it goes by quick no matter what possibly. Okay. Are we, we don't necessarily need to sell that one because that's like a lower cost kind of dude, bro. So maybe we just add this to the the collection. But look at this. Look at, look at Mr. Mammo Tree looking very elegant here. Pretty cool. Let's pop you on down in there. Man, our ghost collection is expanding. Based on your shop level and expansion, there's a 0.3% chance of somebody having enough money to buy it. So do they not only have to have enough money to buy it, but they have to actually go over to it and say, yes, I'm gonna buy this, that reduces the chance even further? Does that mean I need to expand the shop further and that'll increase the chances of a wealthy person coming in? Because the level up, I mean, I can't really control that too much. But I don't know how it actually works. We have good news, September is over, but gift sub discounts are still here. Huh, hadn't seen that pop up before. I'm going back to some legendarios because they give us actual like valuable card pulls. So we gotta supplement our income this way. Ooh, 29 smackaroos, pretty cool. Gimla is 66, ooh, nice, $276. Five and a half years, my longest sub. Thank you, Gimlas. That is big potato and a half right there. And Sergeant Leo, with eight months. You sir, the best love you, Cap. Thank you, much appreciated. Very kind of you, very, very nice and stuff like that. Yeah, so today, big day of gaming. We got this going on, then we're gonna move into lockdown protocol, and then after that, maybe do a little bit of vault hunting, perhaps, perhaps, maybe, maybe. We got some options in here um, of things that we could do after. Okay, let's get some more moolah up in here. Maybe a little plus 10%. He's thinking, he's thinking. Damn it. Imagine if we had just 
we get the ghost on the first pack of the day. Then someone comes into chat and says, I calculate you have about a 0.3% chance of someone coming in and then it just pulled it. Can you imagine if that had happened, the double whammy of ama amazing Omega-ness? That would have been the most insane thing that has ever happened in history. Okay, so here's the thing. I guess the only way that I am actually going to be able to add more stuff or rearrange the shelves is if we actually run out of the product on the shelf and they can't restock it. Because if I just like take a bunch of stuff off here, they're gonna instantly try to like put the stuff back into place, I'm pretty sure. And it's gonna freak me up. Do we still have the box over? We do actually have the box over here. I was just thinking I could stock the things that I've been missing. Like I, ha I did forget to get the red, like, okay. I could try to pull a real cheeky maneuver here. All right, all right. Let's see if he can pull this off. Let's see if I can um, juke our boys out here. Okay, check it. So I'm gonna grab these off, and I'm gonna put that down, and I'm gonna grab this. I'm gonna be really fast about it, and I'm gonna go, ooh, yeah, dude, let's go. We juked him out. We juked him out, that was crazy. He had no idea. What do you mean I can't mix different box Oh, God, that's annoying. I can't mix different box sizes. Um, You know what I can do though? Wait, hold on. That's gonna be freaking annoying. I need to get a different box size that matches the other boxes. Ah, geez, bud. I guess I'll just like temporarily put this over here and then they should be able to grab it in case we need more of these. And then eventually when it's all used up, we'll be good. Okay, $21, that's actually a decent price. Ow, oh wait, guys, what are we doing over here? I think it's holding. Fairly steady? Maybe? Have we hit bottom here? Yeah, check. Hold up. Mm. That is a precipitous chart. Oh my god. No, I get that I might be able to fit the smaller box into the bigger box. The issue is when I order new ones, they come in this. So if I don't have this here, when I order new ones, they're not gonna shelve it. So that's why I need to keep one that's actually like the original box size, if that makes any sense. Uh, I do need to order more bats up in here. It's just annoying that I I did that. Just a little bit annoying. Um, we could do a couple of those and hit the order. Do we have anything else that's uh, running a little bit low? Are these guys running low? hips or are they just oh no they're not running low they're pretty they're pretty good she's about to stonk them up um okay excellent we're doing well on the legendaries so let's keep it going let's keep it going mr norton 43 months of subage thank you very much mate very nice of you shout out to mr norton So what is it, level 30? Is that when we unlock the rare um, Destiny expansion, I believe, and then it's level 35 for the epics and level 40 Ooh, for the legendaries. Good God. I feel like until we get to level 40, we're kind of just, sa we're, we're sacrificing overall profit by opening these just in the hopes of getting the ghost. So, hmm, hmm, excuse me. And the issue, of course, is that these packs, they actually go for a lot of money, but the return, average on average, a value of cards that you get in each pack is in the gutter versus the legendary, which is far better. So, yeah, yeah. But we get good, we get good markup on those. Bad boys, do we have no more rares? Are we out of rares? No, we're not out of rares. They're just not restocking. Are we out of commons? Ew, we might be out of commons, it looks like. So let's get some big common boxes. And then what else do we have? All right, we gotta get one of you. Actually, maybe another one of you, because we got nothing on the shelf there. We have something on the shelf there. God dang it, I was looking incorrectly because, okay, at least I haven't ordered it yet. Just need to do one. Always forget, it's the bottom. Oh wait, no, it's above. Okay, we have one. 
God dang. Uh, do we have epics? Okay, epics we need to order. Um, no, we don't need to order. Those are, oh, the rares we need to order. The epics are good. Uh, it just confuses me to no end with this tags being on the top. It just ruins my life. Do that. And then what else is kind of running low? Um, these are good. These are, I guess I could order more red and more yellow. Stonking boom, more red and more yellow. What else we got? Um, oh, the destiny packs are running pretty low. Let me get some more of those. So many things, so many things. All right, I better place the order before it gets too freaking late. And then they can at least get things on the shelves. Oh my God. Bro, my expenses are insane. $6,778 in a week? That's not even the full week, that's six days. This is crazy. Mr. Norton, did you say it's your monthly rent? Bro, it's your monthly rent in university? What the frick? Are you talking about like you're living in a place with 10 other people? Your m monthly rent at university, $6,700, huh? God, I'm gonna have to pay that. Oh, my money, it's gone, it's gone, it's all over, it's gone. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh God, stinky boys are gonna start infiltrating. This is bad. Basement suite, two bedroom, one bathroom. It's, it's not just you, right? Cause that, there's no way. There's no way. That would be wild. $6,700. Okay. Uh, we may need to add some more of these. How's the market price here? This hasn't really changed in a very, very long time. Dude, I need this card to sell. I don't even know if I'm running net positive at this point with these expenses. The salary, the freaking. Oh my God, the salaries and the rent are gonna, they're gonna, I'm gonna go bust. I don't know if I can keep up with this selling $15 cards. Hey, at least there's a $203 card. Bro. Every now and again, we hit it big, but. 6,700, oh my God. If I had let that go to tomorrow, we would have been looking at like, so our outgoing is, is $7,500 a week. Whew. Creepers, creepers. Yeah, dude, if we're, if we're not selling extremely exorbitantly expensive individual cards, like I'm pretty sure we're just, we're just wrecked, which makes it annoying because it means I can't really, I can't do the destiny packs until we get up to uh, legendary because otherwise I'm just not able to turn a profit. You know, I gotta open up legendaries only until like level 40. I do, to be fair, I have $16,000 in my binder, but it's spread apart through five billion cards. My binder must be so heavy, carrying $16,000 worth of paper in it. Oh my goodness gracious. All right, well, what do we need? Do we have any uh, gamer, ooh, gamer spray. We are out of gamer spray. That's not good right there. Okay, let's get some more gamer spray in. Accessories, oh, we'll do, I guess I could just buy, I guess I could just buy these, right? Hold on though, is this the, are they gonna know to, I don't know if they're actually gonna know to put the gamer spray there, so I'm gonna do that so they know. I don't think there's any other gamer spray locations, okay? So they've decided to put the, okay, so these, they put these there. Let me just do that there. That there, so that's where those go in the future. I'll put you there. That's all good. Do we have any cards? Can I put the card sleeves back with other stuff? I don't know how you clear a shelf 
um, in order to make it so that like, how do you how do you like reset a shelf so it no longer has a thing? That's what I want to know. I don't know if you can. But anyway, alrighty, we're good to go. Start the next day. Profit of negative money because of all the salaries. If you right click the tab, it'll reset it. Nice, okay, thank you for the info. Well, I'm very sad, can't really open the destinies. I think, oh, we're gonna have to drop the price because they went down, didn't they? Let me double check this, but I'm pretty sure that the destiny has not stunked very well. Oh, great. Oh, look at that. It used to be a whopping $9.85, and now it's down a dollar as the recession recessionifies even further. How about this? That's held pretty steady. But of course, as soon as it's something that we're stocking, then away it goes. Goodbye. See you later. Yay, yay, yay. Man. Man. All right, well. Let's open up some more of these dongers. Why didn't I join Block Wars? Well, let me tell you, have I got some tea to spill. I'm bad at monitoring Discord notifications and I had no idea there were any signups or anything like that, so I just, yeah, that's why. <laughs> um, man, people thought I was actually gonna say something juicy there for a second. There was nothing juicy. It was just I'm bad at Discord. So, I right, spilled the tea. Spilled the tea. What's the drama? I didn't know you were a big drama guy. Captain Sparkle's drama arc. This is so exciting. I can't wait to see more of the Captain Sparkle's drama arc. Oh, sorry, I forgot to open. But fortunately, time stand stands still when we don't. It's nice though, how the, the, the employees, they, they stonk. They do stonk it. Wait, why are you here? You're, you're, you're doing the restonking. Uh, I guess he just has no restonking to do because it's all done. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, okay, now he's gonna go. It's cool, they actually, like, if, if we don't open the shop, they're still actually working with time frozen and they're not being compensated for it. Mm hmm, it's kinda cool. But also, he's just standing there while the shop is open because there is no restonking to do. He's still getting his, his pay. God dang. There was never a chance that I would say, boy, have I got some tea to spill unironically. Maybe I need to get to a point where... where I, I can say that unironically, where people believe, ooh, he's being serious right now. All right, guys. Please, somebody buy this. Somebody buy it, I'm begging you. I'm begging you. Man, I'm, you know what I might need to do? I might need to order another one of these card displays here. Hey, quick question. If you uh, if you buy a fancier card display, does it increase people's potential for spending big monies? Hmm, hmm. Turn the main channel into a drama channel, you know? It's tempting, right? It's tempting. No, so it doesn't actually increase their potential to buy even if it's in a fancier container. So you're saying presentation doesn't matter? Dude, look at this, look at this seller's $900 a day. $900 a day. Dude, this is like $300,000 a year in salary expenditures at my card shop. Oh. Excuse me. Dude, when the recession really intensifies, I am gonna be so wrecked. Store size is what gives them more money. Hmm. Hmm. Well, I can't expand this any further until level 30. What's it looking like in Reno Bigly for over here? God, I literally only have the ability to do one additional expansion right now. I'm, I'm capped out. Wow. Oh, no, 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 sorry. I could do, I could go all the way up to here. Okay, I got it. So I have three more that I could do, which is kind of gnarly. No, 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 someone, someone's gonna do it though. I'm a believer in, in my customers. My customers are big, wealthy. Oh, you think 
I should be a one of the drama channels where I I talk about the topic while also just playing a game. You think I should do the uh and I should my my thing of choice should be Minecraft droppers. That'll be my my background medium while discussing the juicy details of whatever the goings on are in in the old industry. Mmm. I'll take that into consideration, you know. Sounds like a business model that no one's ever done before that could maybe just maybe work. Call a booty? Mmm. Call a booty with commentary? I don't think anyone would ever do something like that. Mmm. Not not sure. Ingo with 52 months. Eight months keys left till potato. Slowly making my way. Very cool. And Dexmaster with 35 months of subage. All right, we good? Are we good? We're good on all this. Are there any more SKUs that are like worth getting? 22 bucks for, it is fair. I haven't checked the pricing on this, but okay, it's still, still good. Are we good there? Yep, yeah, we're still pretty popping off. Are we pretty popping off? I'm even be able to bring this up to $29. What about you? You're still pretty good. You are very profitable. You are profitable. You are a frick. Wait, it went up! Bro, 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 Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Green! There's green! Is this the bottom? Any, um, technical, technical analysis, astrology for men, people out there who are, um, you know, able to read this chart and tell me if this is a bottom or not? Anybody, anybody? Big stonks? Come on. Come on, tell me that's a bottom. No, that's not the bottom? <sighs> well, that's fricked, dude. Come on. Wait, do we, are we out of bats again? We're out of bats again. How are we out of bats again? I also need to order some more legendary card packs. Oh boy. Here goes all the money once again. There we go, figurines. We need, I guess these are like flying off the shelves then, aren't they? Let me just make sure they didn't pop the box back. No, I guess that's it. I guess we just don't have it. It's not going back? Nope, okay. Um, dicey, dicey. Let's get that. And then, what else do we need? The destinies are pretty good. The yellow boxes are good. I guess we could use a boosty pack, perhaps one of these. And then we could do, bro, every day we're pushing product, but also I'm going out of stonk on so many things. A The pygmy boys we could do. All right, and then what else, what else? Yeah, we got the legendaries coming in. Okay, I think that's pretty much it. Big order, 1,200 smackaroos coming right up. Back down to 17K. Man, the shop is running like a well-oiled machine now, and I'm making no money. <laughs> this is the trade-off. It feels great. I can spend more time opening cards, and I can spend less time doing other things because I don't have the money. Bro. Ugh. Ugh. Yeah, I miss the simpler times, you know? Remember back in the beginning? It was just us. We were grinding away, doing our best to make it in the world of cards. We were doing everything. We were doing the checkout. We were opening the boxes. We were stocking the shelves. Now, God, would I even know how to stock a shelf again? Have I lost all my abilities? Have I have I lost the ability to do the basic stuff that got me to this in, in the first place? And now we're just spending so much money. Now I got mouths to feed. Now, if we lose our customer base, all of a sudden, I'm gonna have people depending on me, being like, I can't order food for my family this week. And then it's gonna be on me and I'm gonna feel stressed out because of that. Because it's not just me. If it was just me, the shop goes under, it's on me. That's it. No one else can blame me. Now, now we got four people. They're relying on me. $245, thank you, Talon Ryu. You have enabled me to continue the shop and keep it going for, for at least one more day. 
Maybe less, actually, because our daily expenditures are insane. Oh, God. You're right, back in the day when I, I had to manually hit people with the gamer spray. I didn't have machines, I didn't have robots doing it all. Soon enough, we're gonna have the, we're gonna have the Tesla machine man guy standing here and he's gonna be able to smell. He's gonna be like, you're stinky, and then he's gonna spray, and that's gonna be the even upgraded variant. That's gonna be all that robot can do is stand there and spray people with deodorant, because it's definitely not doing anything else. And then, and then that's, and then I'm gonna be like, man, I can't remember, I remember simpler times, but I don't even know how I dealt with it at that, at that point. Um, Vet Girl, thank you for the six months. Very much appreciated. Pretty swick. Why do all of these games have the same map style? I don't actually know what resource library these games are using, but yeah. Yeah, they're definitely all, uh, fishing from the same pond, that's for sure. It's, uh, it's very interesting. Anyway. All right, more cards, more cards. This is how we gotta keep the lights on, even though I have the lights off. Yeah, 33 smackaroos. So big, dude. Bro, my ankles are so itchy every time, every day. Every day, as soon as I go and just double check the pool, see what the status is, immediately my ankles are assaulted by mosquitoes. Like, an unbelievable extent. It's ridiculous. Okay, well, goodbye. Goodbye to more money. Down to 14,000. I think our shop might be running in the negative right now. There is a chance that I'm gonna have to let somebody go unless this big ghost card sells. Uh, Cause I, I feel like this is not working at the moment. Okay, there we go. Oh God, wait, also no one's buying the, uh, no one's buying the individual cards. What's happening here? Oh, what the frick? Wait, nobody's buying the individual cards because all the prices, like, have plummeted. Every single card I've been offering has plummeted in price. What happened? Bruh. Bruh. Every single one. Except for our big guy. Uh, that's, that's good right there. This is, this one's still okay. But dude. That's fine. Why is no one buying that? Holy frick, dude. Oh my god. The plummetation. Every single one is down. Mega. Holy frick. We're dookied. Guys, I can't afford to put the lights on. How have we, how have we hit just Financial ruin so quickly. How did I overhire? Why did I agree to pay the guy? Why did I agree to pay the cashier a salary of like $120,000 a year? I don't understand. I've made a mistake. Okay, at least some of the uh, individual cards should start to move and then maybe we'll get a little bit more money coming in, but did I grow too fast? Shoot, that's what the VCs wanted though. They only invested in me because I promised them infinite growth forever. Did I overpromise? Did I underdeliver? Why did I agree to pay you $120,000 a year in salary? Oh my god. What have I done? You're good at your job. You check them out pretty fast. But $120,000 a year? I may, you know what I, know, I might need to do? What is what does he cost? What does he cost? Hold on, I gotta check. Okay, my man is costing me $150 a day. This guy's costing me $400. You're costing me $300 a day. Do I even let both these guys go? That would save me $200 a day, but I feel like $200 a day isn't even that much in comparison to the other guys. But this guy is like needed. He's really fast. The other guy's reasonably fast. I don't know. Do I get rid of him? Maybe I get rid of him because it's like the people are lining up for him and he's taking a long time when they're not even going for this guy. And then I can get rid of the check stand. 
that's gonna open up more room and then I can possibly put some stuff on display at the front and it'll lure more people in because they'll see, holy frick, he has a $16,000 car. This must be a cool, sh cool shop and then everything will be good. The problem is though, that this, he, my fast guy, he leaves early. Why does he leave early? He doesn't have as much commitment. I would feel really bad firing this guy because he has commitment to the job. He never goes anywhere until the day is done. And that is a commendable thing to do. Man. All right, how are we doing on our inventory over here? Okay, the boxes are looking boxed. So that is good. That is very good. Oh, wait, I can do this now. Heck yeah. So we're consolidated there. Right click, get rid of it. And then you over there. Um, that's a total of mostly full. All right. Oh, I'm going to need to... Let me pile up some of these here really quick. Fire the leave early guy, but the leave early guy, he he checks people out so fast. I feel bad. I do feel bad firing my guy though. Because the guy who's still here, this man here, if it's just him, we're going to get a big line. That's the issue. Like, he's kind of slow. Look at, he's pretty slow. He's pretty slow. Like, he can't just be him. It take... <sighs> okay, here's what we're going to have to do. I'm going to let him finish off the day. He's been, he's been good to us. It's not going to feel good. It really is not. It's not going to feel nice. All right, he went home. Maybe, you know what? Maybe if we let him go, then our, our boy who's actually pretty speedy, maybe he'll actually, uh, maybe he'll stay later. Fire myself. I don't think I can do that. I don't think legally I can do that. I'm responsible for the business in the eyes of the law. So, eat any good books lately? Thank you for the 27 months. Congrats on 9999 subs on Captain Sparkles 2. Bro, we are getting close. It's 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 doing. It's going close. Oh no, I gotta fire them to their face. I can't even do it remotely from the app. I can't even do it remotely from the app. Oh no, but we're negative again. Ah. Oh. On hemorrhaging money. God. I gotta do anything to cut costs. Oh, no. We were so profitable for so long, and now I'm hemorrhaging. Oh, God. I gotta, oh, it's not good. Oh, no. All right, I gotta let him show up for work. Oh, he. hey, he's in early today. Okay, okay. Wait. You know what? You know what? Wait, how do I... How do I grab how do I grab the register? Hello? Oh, there we go. Um I'm gonna box it up. I'm gonna sell it. Hey, it's 750 in the bank. Alright, man. Hey, I'm gonna I'm gonna just move this right over here. Okay, if you don't mind. I'm just gonna move it right here. Perfecto. There you can go back. You're good. Uh wait, where's our boy? There's our boy. Um Oh God, he's actually, oh, he still thinks it's his register. So, I'm really sorry about this, man. But, um, I gotta cut costs. You've been great at your job. Like, I mean, you're slow, but that was the expectation. Um, I'm sure, you know, you're reliable, you stayed late, you came in early. I'm sure you're going to land on your feet. A lot of people would be lucky to have you. Um, but I got to let you go. Okay. Hey, man, back to the register. All right. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. All you, you just need, hey, um, also, once you drop that on the shelf, uh, we got to have a, we got to have a talk. Um. Yeah, you were kind of always due to it, everything, so... Uh... Yeah, bye. Um, okay. Cool. Let's open the shop. And we'll be, we'll be good to go.
All right. Look at this stinky boy. He's not gonna be stinky anymore. Giving away all this free gamer spray. And the people don't even appreciate it. This is one of the things that's bringing my business under is all of the free spray that I'm using on people. And they're just like, bleh, bleh. how dare you spray me? This is ridiculous. Like they don't even appreciate this. But if I don't do it, then other customers get mad at me. Not the other, not the other stinky people. They get mad at me. As if I'm the one responsible for them being stinky. Like, I'm sorry. Why is this my responsibility? Okay, so I, the issue is it remembers the price from when you've last done it. But when the market continues to crater and you keep putting down the things, right? Then all of a sudden you're getting, you're fricked. That's the issue. But this on the other hand actually went up. So I gotta remember, I gotta actually keep checking the prices because the thing is we've been opening these legendaries for so long now. There's been so many days for the prices to adjust and that's why they weren't moving anymore. Um, so yeah, 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 yeah. We, gotta, we gotta monitor. You gotta monitor and make sure that every, this is crazy. This, this can't keep happening. Oh my God, what happened to our gamer spray? You want another tragic graph? You want another tragic Nickelback moment? Jesus. I mean, this is what happens when you give it away for free. Like, crazy. Mm. Oh my god. Buy high, sell low. That's what I always say. That's what I always say. All right, all right. Man, I want to open up some more destinies and stuff. And get more... Get more ghosts. But here we are. Getting fricked up. Gotta check. Holy frick, they used to be... Oh god. Oh my god, the prices! Why do they plummet? Why do they all plummet? I don't know. Nobody knows. Nobody knows why the prices keep plummeting. How are you doing? Oh my god, it actually keeps going up though. This one is stonks and a half. Holy frick. I gotta, I gotta grab Jack Turn. I wanna see where we are on Jack Turn stonks real quick. Oh, Jack Turn stonks actually keep going up. Holy frick. Dang. Oh, that's good, that's good. Rofapono, 10 months and a little ST with 14 months, very much appreciated. All right, let's open them up, let's open them up. Oh yeah, 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 you're right. Now that we've uh, gotten, re ooh, look at that. 136 fist strong Garino. Very good. Yeah, should we put a display more adjacent to the window maybe? Maybe, maybe, I don't know. I don't know, I don't know. So, it's, I guess, only a slightly higher percent chance of a person coming into the shop, buying our ghost, than it is to actually get the ghost in the first place. <laughs> that's, that's fun right there, that's fun. Mmm, okay, I could though. Do we think if we moved this over here that maybe, maybe the people would feel more tempted? You know, they see it in the window and they're like, dang, look at that bad boy. That's what they say, that's what they say. And then they buy it immediately. All right, Mr. Fister for that's gonna be too much, god dang it. And then, let me guess, you're good, okay, good, 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 good. You are way too expensive now. Frick me up. Uh, let's go $15, done. Good. Buy this one, buy it, buy it, buy it. God, she didn't even look, 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 look. She didn't wanna look. Dang, look at all, they're all looking like, they're, they're, they're looking at the, they're looking at the individuals. They're thinking about it, and then they don't do it. Uh, 
Uh, which one did I just put down? I don't know which one I put down. Um, oh. Yeah, that one... We'll do 16 there. Done. Come on, dude. Okay, we gotta open some more up. You gotta get big, big cards. Okay. There's a part of me that feels like maybe I should just list Jack turn as well. And that way I get, like, at least I get double the chance. I don't know if that's how it actually works. But, like, if I put Jack turn out there, then maybe I double my chances of one of the big cards selling. Then whatever one doesn't sell, I can just take that and I can put it back in the display. Even though I do, I think Jack turn looks cooler. But it might give me some, you know, additional odds. Maybe. I don't think I don't think that the uh, it being 10% on an expensive card has any impact versus 10% on a cheap card. I think it reads percentages the same way. So yeah, I don't know. Get another ghost via destiny. Yeah, uh, I don't know. I don't know. No, but I I don't think that going close. I think going closer to market. The only way that that would work is maybe if somebody comes into the shop and the game basically gives them $15,000 instead of 16000 I guess I would be missing out on their potential purchase. Um, maybe. But I don't know. Holy, look at the reduction here. God. Are there any cards that just aren't out here plummeting? Plummeting! In value. Man. In your fancy leather jacket, I was thinking maybe you were the one to pull a Papa Bezos. Dang it. All right, well, what else do we have? Hmm. We get there. Oh, I'm gonna need some more uh, legendarios up in here, unfortunately. Because I just opened them all myself. $724 in legendaries. Let's go. Okay, most of the other stuff is good, so. So you like to see. There we go. More legendaries coming right up. Out of curiosity, so what what kind of event would increase the value of our card? That's the question. It's a risk, because it'll be expensive each day to host the event. But does does the does Mango over here, whatever Mango Man, does that belong to a certain category that would um you know go up if we change the event. So it's a full hollow. Oh, hollow heaven. That's probably the one. Hollow heaven because it's a full art hollow. I bet that would increase, but yeah, we're not even we're not even close to it. We're not even close to it. Ugh. Type. Type might work. It is gonna drop what I'm making from, what, okay, do we know, how do we know what kind of type it is? Let me see. I have no idea what kind of type that is. God, Royal Llama over $20,000 now. That's the most expensive I've seen, 20K, whoo. That's crazy. Anyway, where is it? It's, a uh, Mang Magnoria. Magnoria. Does seem grassy. Lord, what is name? 73 months. Thank you very much. Do we think that's, uh... 
earth, I guess. It's kind of flowery looking. Manage event. Let's see. What do we got? So, edit. Earth? Probably earth? Oh, no. Oh, look at its, like, normal card. All right. Let's check this. It won't change it until tomorrow anyway, so we're not, like, on the clock or anything like that. Um, cards. Tetramon base. Oh, God. There's so many pages, though. Where am I going to find it? I have absolutely no idea. Uh, Magnoria, Magnoria, come on, where are you at? Where are you at? Oh boy. You're somewhere in here. I wish I could search. Wish I could search. Does it show? Okay, it's only one card per. I passed it. Oh no, how far back was it? How do I pass it when I have to literally go through four different evolutions of the whole freaking thing? How did I be so big dumb? Oh, there it- Oh, because it doesn't have evolutions. It's its own thing. Okay, so that's- Is that grass? Or earth? Dang, look at those stonks right there. Anybody know how to tell? It looks very earth or grass. Um, hopefully it is. Okie dokie then, let's uh, run the thing. I'll pull one up in the binder. Uh, oh God, how am I gonna find it? Uh, I don't know. It doesn't seem to tell me. I got no idea. Pay bills! Ugh, the electricity is due today. Okay. Nobody has any idea how to actually tell what type a Pokemon is, but I'm just gonna do wind, water, and earth. Wind, water, earth, it's gotta, it's gotta be earth. It's gotta be earth. Okay. For tomorrow, we shall see. Maybe it'll go uppies. Um, but in the meantime, let me go and lay out some more guards. Hopefully everyone's not just gonna absolutely plummet tomorrow outside of you. But, um, okay, wait for the checkout, wait for the checkout. Trying a different event type. I'm sure that people were like, do a different event for absolutely ages. So, sorry about that. Very nice. 135th strong. If you look in the shop, it tells you what color each type. If I look in the shop, I'm not sure what you mean by that. If I look in the shop, it tells me what color each type. Oh, okay. But just as far as like these, I'm assuming because it's green, it's it's probably earth, right? Because earth battle deck, fire battle deck, water, wind, looks like it's probably earth. That's my best guess. We'll see how it pans out tomorrow. Um, how are we here? Are we most- Oh, we're actually pretty good. Cool. That has not moved. Good, good. Alright, I want to see a surge in pricing on you. There's so many people who are still getting checked out. Wait. I miss him already. I miss him already. I have to do this manually. He left. He did leave early. No, he left early. What the heck? My old reliable employee. Oh, no. And I let him go. I let him go. That was a big order, though. Thank you very much, man. Oh, no. Oh, frick. 
I really fricked it up. I have 10 of these? Oh my god. Well, next day. Well, we, we profited a bit. That was nice. Okay. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. let's see. How are we doing? How are we doing? I don't think the market price changed at all. Big sad. Big sad. How'd Jack turn end up doing out of curiosity? Still kind of chilling in the same place. All right. Wasn't that profit due to selling furniture? I only sold one register, okay? Hey, why don't you... Why don't you freaking stay late like the other guy? Ugh. This is actual tragedy, bro. What am I gonna do? Okay, do it, do it. This big man, big man, big man. Big man! Not a big man. Not a big man. Very sad. All right, all right, all right. One of these days though, it's gonna hit and it's gonna be huge. Okay, do we need more Destinies? Destinies are actually selling though. Okay, 31 bucks. Not bad, not bad. Ooh. 210 smackaroos. I should put two really cheap cards around it to trick them. I don't know that that's how uh, things work. At least we got a big 210 smackarooski. That's very good. Look at that. Look at that. Wait, he's thinking about it. He didn't do it. God dang it, he didn't do it. Oh, plummeted, plummeted, plummeted pricing. Jeez. That's so sad for us. Are you good? Nope. Pricing's plummeted. Recession's hitting. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. She's not doing it. Don't let your dreams be dreams. Just do it. I know you want the card. I know you want it. Hey, that was nice. Do I only sell duplicates? No. No. I sell because I need money. Because my outgoing expenditures are insane. And as soon as the freaking bill day hits, I'm dead. I have to burp. Understand why the child gets so frustrated and cries about the burping thing because it's just I want to burp, but I don't want to burp. Frick. There we go. Oh, 278. That's plummeted. That's absolutely plummeted. That's fricked. Absolutely fricked. Recession-like costs. Come on, come on, come on. Somebody, please. <sighs> Nobody will buy my card, dude. Nobody will buy my card. Holding st like, look at that. It's a good graph. It's a very nice graph. Ugh. So messed up. It's the most, is the 20, the 20 K is the most expensive. I wonder what's next on the list. Ooh, Kyan B 17 K. I didn't mean to exit out of there. We're almost at 20,000 again though. At least, you know, for, for a little bit until bill pay happens. Okay, holding, Ooh. Oh, we were holding okay there for a little bit. Ah, <sighs> put it closer to the cashier. Surely that'll make a difference if we do the positioning. We just gotta put this right next to the cashier and then they'll definitely buy, we'll definitely buy it, right? You guys gotta stonk the uh, Legendarios, bro. Come 
Come on. Come on. Come on. Give me another big one. Okay, I, I am... I'm genuinely, though, I'm on the verge of actually listing Jack turn just to try to increase the odds. And then it's like, hey, we'll, we'll have one full art hollow ghost left over. Right? I'm like, what do you, what do you think? What do you think? Should I do it? Should I do it? Should I list Jack turn? Should I do? Oh my god, at least, hey, they're buying up the frick out of these cards. Do it. Don't list. Be strong. Don't give in. Up to you. Man, oh man. How do I deal with all of these conflicting bits of input? Okay, that one's good, at least. Oh, that one actually went up. Crazy. You don't expect to see that. There's so many of these. No wonder the market's going to drop. That's actually still uh, reasonably priced as well. All right, you guys want me to pull this? You want me to pull this? Mmm. Well, it's looking a lot like the uh, yeses for listing Jack Turn are gonna take it. So, boy oh boy, it may be what we've gotta do. It may be what we gotta do, but just keep in mind, yeah, the yes is one. All right, okay. We're, sell we're only selling one of the two, right? And we're doing it at 20% markup as well. So, whew, $20,500. Yeah, there's no way that Jack Turn is, is selling first versus, uh, th there's no way. But also, if it sold for $20,500, that would be just crazy, crazy, crazy. Also, I might do something crazy and just... <laughs> Six cents. Oh, I'm gonna list for seven. No, I can't do it. I can't do it to you. I can't do it. I gotta put you in, in the binder. I gotta put you in the binder. There you go. Back in the binder. You're gonna live in our collection forever, but I do think the ghosts should remain as ghosts only inside of this. I, I couldn't sell it. I couldn't bring myself to do it. There was too much sentimental value in that. <laughs> Thank God he didn't sell it for seven cents. Thank God it would have been a disaster. I wouldn't have known how to live with myself any longer. What was Lup Up? Oh, Lup Up, just an extremely valuable um, base set card. Extremely valuable. One of the one of the most valuable that we've ever ever come across. Eighteen dollars, nice. I should also check. Um, we should check some market prices on the binder. Oh my God! It's going up. Holy frick! Holy frick, we hit a bottom, dude. We actually might have hit a bottom. Done. Back up to 55. Holy yak. Oh, it's just schmoovin' and groovin' now, isn't it? What the heck? This is crazy. Meanwhile, Gamer Spray is plummeting because I give it all away for free. Mm-hmm, Pretty cool, pretty cool. Wow, that is the one of the... Think about it. No! Stop saying you're broke! Put your mind to it, and you can afford anything with enough debt. You know? Damn it! Oh, I thought I thought we had a chance there for a moment. I really did. How are we doing here? Oh. Oh. Man. This is reverse stonks. Oh, it's just reverse stonks. Ay, ay, ay. Yeah, exactly. All you gotta do is take out a small loan 
of like $50,000 and then you'll be good to go. Okay, what else we got here, man? What else we got? We gotta, I guess, open up some more dudes. Anything out? Oh God, we have two. Two gamer sprays out and this is why the price is plummeting. Why buy the gamer spray when you can just take a free bath and complain about it? Like an ungrateful little stinky boy. All right, how are we looking here? I mean, the stonking is going great though. Yeah, I do believe that expanding the store probably increases the potential for uh, spinge. But also it just increases the rent to unfathomable heights. I mean, like all this money that we think we've made right now is just going to go away as soon, soon as the bills hit. At least we have a few more days until that happens, but jeez, dude. Six more days and we've already accumulated a thousand dollars in rent. Can you even believe it? How is our market pricing? Good, good. We're keeping it, ooh, that is not good, oof. And yeah, 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 no, I, I, um, you put full expansion, $500 a day, you went for 502K plus on tables? Really? I don't think I have full expansion. I don't think I have it unlocked. It's too high a level. I need 2,500 tables, I think, in order to get there, if I'm not mistaken. Um, let me see. Where is it? Yeah, full expansion, I need more people, so. Sad, sad, sad. And what is that? Oh, you don't even, it doesn't tell you what the benefits are there. Hmm, sad. I bet it's like destiny cards increase in value or something, but all others might decrease, which is a bit risky for us to do. But, you know. Okay, I gotta take a quick look ski over here, see if there's anything. We need to order more of the binders. That makes sense, they were flying off the shelves, obviously. More of the binders, more of the commons. More of the bat, oh, the bats are flying off the shelves too. Flying off, uh, way off the bat. Um, okay, I think I need sleeves. Sleeves, binder, common, red. Okay, so. Wait, no, 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 was it regular common, it was regular common pack not booster, right? Yeah. Right. It was sleeves. Um, and then binder. I guess I could do these. I gotta do like two of these. And then the bats, the destinies. It's the most difficult thing to do is just to remember where things go. Um, or what I need to order after looking at the shelf. It's actually the most difficult part of the whole thing. All right. That, 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 that's good. Do we need any more of the pygmies? I think we might need some pygmies. These things are moving a lot more than I would have expected, too. All right, well, I, and then maybe a legendary just for good measure. Okay, big old order right there coming right up. I don't know if our man's is left for the day. He probably has. You think I should do the EX one? But the problem is it might just plummet our... Uh, it might just absolutely plummet our, our card values, which would be very not good. Very not good at all. That hasn't sold. Okay, I see you, man. All right, all right, all right. Was it $51? That's a pretty good checkout total right there. Okay, next day, before I have to do too many checkouts. Eighteen hundred smackaroo skis. Yeah, they only plummet until you change the event, I assume. Let's see, let's check our market values. What do we got? Oh my God, dude, this thing keeps going. What? Hold on, 14,700. And then plus 10%, plus 10 Jesus, that's what it would be if we did double plus 10%, that's crazy. So maybe we bring it up to 17,000. What about Jack turn? 
Jack turn has stayed basically the same. But that was, okay, that must have been impacted by the Earth event. I think that's what happened there. Wow. Let's open it up. All right, stinky boys, it's time. God dang it, nope, go. Urgh. I just wanna open the store. That must have been huge there. Okay, big stonks, big stonks. Up five hundred fifty-five dollars Woo! Jeez! And then what about over here? Where's Jack turn again? Jack turn hasn't moved, but that's fine. Oh my god, that's mega. Okay. I mean, if we can sell that thing at that price, then it will have all been worth. Yes, it would have. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Big boxes. Take them all in, man. Walk faster, though. Seriously, holy frick, walk faster. Let's see if we can get a few. Uh, maybe we can get a ghost. Maybe we can get a ghost. Also, what time is it? Oh, God, it's 12.55. I don't think I'm going to be able to make it through the entire day, but I'll make the level 27, at least. Before we have to play Lockdown Protocol. Okay, okay. Come on, come on, come on. Big money ghost. Big money ghost. No, not a big money ghost. Sad. Thanks for restonking really quick. I love how most of his restonks are just because I'm pulling cards off of the freaking... Wait, is he gonna get it? Dang it! I saw him looking. I saw him eyeing, and then he didn't pull the trigger. Ugh! Ooh, 142. That's pretty nice. Ooh, that's pretty nice. Okay. Getting some pulls here. That's very good. At the end of the day, opening the card packs, I do believe, has been highly profitable for us. So, all in all, pretty good stuff. There we go. 157, 255, 400 bucks right there. Come on, somebody bring it in. Just take a look. It could be in your book, or binder of cards. A, a ghost rainbow. Man. All right, we got a few more batches until we gotta go. It's a good price, but I'm broke. <laughs> and thanks, guys. Thanks. Mm -hmm. Gotta hit the pole, gotta hit the pole. Ten dollars is not the pole. Who would have thought that it's harder to move the valuable card than it is to pull the valuable card in the first place? That's the craziest part of it all. Oh, man. Okay. Most of the shelves, they're looking stunked. They're looking pretty stunked. It's very nice. Our stonking boy is doing a good job. Maybe the ultimate goal for us in this game is just selling a ghost hollow. Because that, that, I mean, that seems to be the most challenging thing. I do need to make more bundles. You're so right. We're playing Minecraft. We're making bundles. We're storing our inventory in it. We're avoiding clever clutter. Uh, mastermind, 200 bits. Am I going to be doing vaults today? We'll see. I don't know. Maybe, maybe. No way to know for sure. What is that? Okay, that's pretty good on market price. That's good on market price. That could go up a little bit. All righty, very good. Think about it. Think about it. He's not thinking about it. He's not thinking about it. You need to think about it and do it. Just freaking do it. Well, um, legendaries are good. Did he pick all the boxes out of the street? There's still one more that hasn't been stonked yet. That's okay. 32 bucks. You would think that us having the big cards in the window would lure somebody off the street. They'd be like, oh, I gotta go in here. But no, think about it, think about it, think about it. Every time I see someone walk behind that counter, my hopes get elevated for just a moment before they are dashed in a million pieces. Also, oof to that right there. Oof to that right there. And how are we doing on binders? How are the binders doing? Wow. Look at that. 
Look at that. That's, that's, that's called sticking with it. Through the bottom. Well, guys. Look at it. Look at it. Damn it. Dang it. Okay. I'm gonna have to get going to, look at it. Oh, I thought he was gonna grab it. Unfortunately, everybody, I will need to depart to the next video game. But that's about it for now. Thanks, everybody, for watching. I hope you've enjoyed. We'll sell one of these next time. Definitely gonna happen at some point. I may need to expand the shop further, but we'll see. Uh, make sure to like the video, subscribe to Captain Sparkles 2 um, in order to catch the remainder of this series and follow at twitch.tv slash Captain Sparkles in order to catch these live. And of course, playlist in the description if you've missed any episodes and you want to see how it is that we got here. That was crazy. Ghost pull on the first pack. That was kind of a highlight of the day, wasn't it? Yes, it was. All right. Well, we didn't get any more, but at least we got a $50 man that is now, was well, $50, depreciated the frick. <gasps> you can. No, you knew if you wanted it, you knew you wanted it. You knew, you knew, you, you, do it. Damn it, stop being broke. Goodbye.